Welcome to another episode of Drawing Fast, Not a User's Guide to Gunslinging. And with you today is my pen, my trusty old pen here. And first thing I notice about our drawing today is it's amazing, right? Because it's drawing something that I don't even know what it's drawing. But right away, I can tell you, I've discovered what it is, and it's it's Dracula. Ugh. And those are his eyes, okay? And he looks a little shot out because cause he is. Because today we're going to draw Dracula uh, ODing on blood, okay? And this is going to be a person's here. His neck uh, is missing blood. And it's just a stranger who Dracula's eaten, okay? Can you get that? And then the stranger, his legs are, his legs are still in the other room. He didn't even get a chance to get in the bathroom with Dracula yet. And of course, Dracula has a cape and he has arms that grab his, 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 uh, his food. So there you go. And when you, when Dracula drinks like that, so then what happens is Dracula is going to lay down over here. This is the future Dracula. After he's in his coma from drinking so much blood. And then this is his cape. Just move it around like that. Just go ahead and just swish it in there. Okay? And then don't be afraid to just make the guy over here the guy, the owner of the shoe store. His name's Frederike. And he's... He's a little upset to see Dracula in such a state. He has a mullet. And he's very... He's fat, because he doesn't move around much. Okay, he's got wheels on his feet. And that's what he does, and he's calling the ambulance, yelling out the window. Uh, whatever he yells is something. Help. And then someone comes and... When Dracula gets rescued, He's no longer overdosing, he's gonna go up to Dracula heaven. And it's a beautiful picture there, and we can just put some final touches on it. Sometimes I like to put little just blood stains in the background, or just little globs of hair that are just fallen from anywhere. And really, you can just put these anywhere, you know, just design your own globs of hair like that. And Whatever, sometimes there's a cat, sometimes they're in the lobby of bathrooms and stuff, and you just go ahead and draw a little kitty cat. It's a little cute little kitty there. No big deal. And then an amazing picture again. And uh, thanks for joining me. And tune in next time when I show you how to draw God. <laughs>